What's up guys, Groovy Guitar Dude here with a beginner guitar lesson for O Come to the Altar by Elevation Worship. If you like this video and it helps you out, hit that subscribe button and let me know in the comments below what other worship songs that you want to learn on guitar. Guys, the first thing you want to know to play O Come to the Altar is that we need a capo on 4th fret. The next thing you want to know to play O Come to the Altar is the four chords we need to play this song. The first one is G. The next one is C add 9. The next one is E minor. And the last one is A minor. And I'll have chord charts for all of those in the comments below for those of you who need them. We're gonna start out with verse. For verse, our chord progression is gonna go G, C, G, C, E minor, and then back to C. And then we're gonna repeat that twice per verse. Our strum pattern for that is gonna be down, down, up, down, up, twice for each chord. So one time through that with the G. So when you put all that together guys, our verses should look something like this. From there guys, we're in a chorus. Our chorus chord progression is gonna be G, A minor, E minor, and C. And our strum pattern is gonna be the same strum pattern, but we're gonna do it a different amount of times for each chord. So for our G and our A minor, we're gonna do twice through, down, down, up, down, up. And then for our E minor, we're gonna do it three times. So three times through down, down, up, down, up for E minor, and then just once through for C. I know that sounds a little bit confusing. I promise it's not as confusing as it seems like it is. I'm gonna play through it a couple of times to show you what it looks like and it'll make more sense. And guys, the last thing you need to know for O Come to the Altar is the bridge. For the bridge, our chord progression is gonna be G, E minor, C, and then back to G. And we're gonna be using that same strum pattern, down, down, up, down, up for each chord, but we're gonna do it four times per chord. The key thing about this bridge is it's gonna start really light, like really, really light, just barely strumming, and then we're gonna build it up to really, 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 really big at the very end. So that's the thing, is you wanna start really low, build it up, build it up, build it up, build it up, and then get really big towards the end whenever we go into that final chorus. So a couple times through that, guys, with a little bit of a build in there, will look something like this. And guys, that's everything that you need to know to play O Come to the Altar on guitar. As always, if you have any questions, you can hit me up in the comments below. I'm usually pretty quick getting back to those. And again, guys, if this video helped you out, hit that subscribe button. I have about 460 other guitar and ukulele lessons, and I usually try to post at least three to five new lessons every single week. So if you're learning guitar or ukulele, there could not be a more perfect channel for you to check out. If you have any song requests, I do two of those from the comments every single week, but I get a ton of them. So if you want to guarantee that I'll get to your song request, hit up my Patreon. Patreon, links in the description. Guys, this is a beautiful worship song. We've been playing it at my church a whole lot lately, and I just I just love it. The it's actually pretty simple to play on guitar overall. It's not too crazy difficult, but I think it's really powerful and it's very genuine and authentic. And a lot of times 
you don't find a whole lot of music that's like that. And that's what really stands out in this song for me. And I just love playing it. Like I said, it's real simple. It's pretty much the same strum pattern the whole way through. All the chords are pretty basic and simple. Um, but and it's, it's really repetitive too. But it just, for some reason, the lyrics and the way the guitar ties in together and everything builds up, it just feels really, really genuine. And that's what I love in a song is when it feels real genuine. So guys, I hope y'all enjoyed playing this song as much as I did. I hope you have an awesome Sunday and I'll see y'all soon.